One year later and the same result, the Temple Owls hoisted the AAC East Division trophy here on Lincoln Financial Field, and the road to get here was not easy. Take a look at the Sports Desk exclusive road to the championship. A four-year starting quarterback, one of the conference's most electrifying rushers, and a top-ranked defense that returned six starters. Hopes were high for Temple football. Matt Rule is looking to become the first Temple coach all time with consecutive 10 win seasons, and that journey is going to start tonight. And when the Owls were poised to make a statement on opening night, Army served them a startling wake-up call. Backpedaling up, pass is intercepted. It was dropped and intercepted, and the drive stalls for Temple. They're going to pitch it out now. Here's Tyler Campbell kicks into the game. Campbell's going to run into the end zone. Almost untouched, and he will score. Davidson, a lot of room to run into the end zone for a touchdown. Army goes ahead 27 to 13, and that should do it. The teams will exchange handshakes and head to the locker room. Probably hear our team. I mean, we've got to we've got to do something here quickly to get ourselves back on track. We know what we got to do to get better, and you know, we, we might have needed this game to realize to make us realize what type of team we are. A disappointing opening night for Temple. Final score here from Lincoln Financial Field, Army 28, Temple 13. The FCS opponent Stony Brook in week two served to be a great bounce back game for the Owls. Walker's gonna drop back, being chased. Walker running around, throws to the end zone and he's got his man for a touchdown, Broder Gansey. Temple wins it 38 nothing. We'll see you next week from State College at Beaver Stadium for Temple and Penn State. The 1-1 one one Temple Owls have traveled up to State College to take on the 1-1 one one Penn State Nittany Lions in a battle of PA supremacy. They're facing the first quarterback that can effectively put the ball in the air. A raucous environment here. We expected a big crowd and, of course, nothing short of that here this afternoon. Penn State struck early and often, and the freshman quarterback had his way with the Owls defense. Masuli with time steps up, slings it down the middle of the field. There's Chris Godwin wide open. And he is going to walk into the end zone for a touchdown. McSorley rolling out. McSorley being chased by Jared Allen, diving for the pylon. And they're going to say he got it. This Temple defense just looks bad. And they're going to have to figure something out in the locker room or this is going to get all close. McSorley fakes the handoff. Going to throw. Pass is picked off. Come on, Randall. This is a pivotal fourth and goal. Walker going to try to tuck it and run. And he's in. He leaps over a couple of Penn State defenders for the touchdown. They motion Thomas. Here's that check sweep again. John Thomas into the end zone for the touchdown. It all came down to one play in a tie game with the Nittany Lions over the top. Here's Barkley up the middle. Room to run. Barkley, nice cut. Barkley is gone. Saquon Barkley is going to run into the end zone. A valiant effort today from Temple, but they come up just short here in State College. We feel like we have a good team, and I think you saw spurts and moments where we look like a really, really good team. So we'll uh, keep trying to grow them and, and come back next week, try to get back to 2-2, two and two, and then make a run in the conference. Just like that, the Owls were able to bounce back against the Charlotte 49ers. Right, slings it down the field. He's got Broder Yancey. Yancey gets away from a would-be tackler, and Yancey's going to roll into the end zone. Broder Yancey. Thomas to back. Thomas, outside handoff, cuts it back to his right. John Thomas, he slips the tackle, he's in for a touchdown. Armstead running with it, going to be tripped up, bounces it outside, and he gets into the end zone. So that will do it. Temple is going to win 48-20. to And the SMU Mustangs came to town for the Owls' first AAC matchup of the year. Walker going to take a shot deep for Vettel Bryant. Bryant's got it! Vettel Bryant with a touchdown. Thomas running left, trying to bounce it outside, makes a man miss. John Thomas gets into the end zone. Being chased, loses the football. And he's going to be picked up by Roman Deloach. And Deloach scores. As Temple now has put the nail in the coffin. Temple takes on the Memphis Tigers tonight at 8 o'clock, their second AAC matchup of the year. On the road, short turnaround for the Owls. It's probably going to be a different story tonight against a very, very hot Memphis offense. Nice cut. Back inside. Dorsey is on the Dorsey is getting out of the defense. Yes, touchdown. Walker throws metal, tipped up and intercepted. And this time, Avery hangs on. Avery, touchdown. Will 
throw. He was behind the line. He's got his man open. Thomas. Touchdown, Temple. Kick off to the five. The return with a big opening to the 40. To midfield. And Pollard is going to go all the way. What an answer. Walker throws. And it's intercepted. Picked off. And Memphis goes down. Chauncey Lanier will end the game with the pick. The Owls then traveled to Central Florida with high hopes, considering the Black Knights had zero wins in 2015. Here we go with no timeouts. Temple's got to go 70 yards. We've seen some crazy finishes this I'm year. I'm not calling this one yeah. until it's zeroes. Walker fires, receiver open. They pick up to the 50-yard line. 22 seconds to go. Walker finds an open receiver, and it is Bryant again. Job Walker gunning and it's caught to the 10 yard line inside there. Clock is running. Six. He won't spike it under pressure to the end zone. Caught! Touchdown, Tempo! Kirkwood with one second to go. The Owls have their first lead of the night. That's it. Temple has stolen this game, winning it with one second to go. The winner of this game is actually going to take the lead in the East in the AAC, and that's just huge for both teams. Yeah, the loser of this game actually has virtually no shot at the American Conference Championship game. Handoff now, Armstead, Armstead with the boot to run, McCall, Armstead, Armstead, on top one, Armstead, is in the open field. Can he get over the end zone, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown! Right, Armstead, off right tackle, room to run, Armstead down the right sideline, he's in for a touchdown! Handoff, Thomas running into the end zone, untouched! I think we're almost at a loss of words, and I don't say that often, but this has really been a performance, the, the best performance of the season for the Owls. Temple gets a very impressive 46-30 win against the South Florida Bulls. Temple's going to be looking to win their third straight game for the first time this season. They're going to be hosting a Cincinnati team with a recent resurgence. Walker, short drop out of the shotgun, looking far down the sideline, pass is caught by Adonis Jennings! Jennings goes into the end zone for a touchdown! Ventel Bryant continues his urge since returning from an injury. Excellent pass from Walker to find uh, Bryant right before that hole closed. Handoff Armstead running straight ahead, runs into a couple of Cincinnati defenders, can he pull his way into the end zone? No whistle! And now he rolls over and is in for a touchdown! Temple is going to win at 34-13. A very impressive showing today from Temple, specifically in the second half. Holding Cincinnati Spoolish John, in the final 30 minutes. Temple comes in rolling, fresh off a win against Cincinnati the week before, a dominating win against USF, one of the conference's top opponents. They're going to be facing a UConn team that hasn't fared so well this season, only 3-6 and six on the year. Pass is caught to the end zone for a touchdown by Jahan Thomas. Throwing to the end zone, wide open, it is Jahan Thomas. So Jahan Thomas scores another touchdown. It's a pass is caught over the middle of about to load for that touchdown. And it will be a shutout for Temple. Al's get out of here with a 21 0 win. Let's get it, baby! Looking for him again into the end zone. It is caught. Touchdown, Temple. Flips it out to Thomas. He has room. Down to the 30. Inside the 20. Cuts it back inside the 5. Touchdown, Jahan Thomas. Congratulations to the Temple Owls and Matt Rule as they dominated this game all afternoon, picking up their eighth win. Temple football's 2016 season has come down to one game with one win. They're in the AAC championship. They'll be hoisting the East Division trophy for the second straight season on Lincoln Financial Field. Temple extends to a 13-7 lead. Hits you back to work. Lost the football, was knocked out of his hands, and Temple has it as a whole. Jahan Thomas cuts back to the left side. Jagger Gardner adds to the running back party. Touchdown number five on the night for the Owls. And a fitting way to cap the night. Next Saturday, noon Eastern, ABC. This will be the matchup. Temple's vaunted defense, Davies' vaunted offense. Hey, 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 hey,